Hey guys, Eddie at Ignite Spot Accounting. Today we are talking about drinking your own Kool-Aid. As an entrepreneur, whenever you get ready to launch a new company or even move into a new vertical space within your existing company, it's really exciting. You start forecasting sales and start planning things and growth and potential, and uh, that's all wonderful. But the problem is that most of the time, those forecasts are built on hope. And because they're built on hope, a lot of businesses fail. We've all heard the statistics about how, you know, 20, 30, 40, 50% of businesses fell within the first couple of years. And really, it's because all of the, uh, the forecasts are built on hope. So this is the concept. Don't drink your own Kool-Aid. Don't get caught up in the excitement of your business or your product. Don't get caught up in your own awesomeness. Even though you are awesome, uh, step back from that for just a minute and realize that this might fail. And if it fails, what are you going to do? Um, I don't want to kill your passion or, or your optimism for your, for your project. I just want you to step back and realistically say, what are my triggers to know if this is a successful project before I lose all of my money on it? Uh, and what are my triggers to know if this is an unsuccessful project? So what I would suggest is halfway through, well, let's do set, setting a budget, for example, of maybe $10,000, whatever it is, something that's small enough you can afford to lose it, but it's large enough that you can test your market. Uh, putting $10,000 out there and at the end of $10,000, are you able to grow an audience or create a certain set of metrics that proves whether this idea is worth exploring or not? So uh, in the blog post below, we talk about a concept called taking a cold shower of self-honesty. When you create your projects, make sure at the end before you launch to jump in that cold shower and ask yourself some really self-investigative questions like, are my forecasts based on data? and research or are or are those forecasts based on hope and uh you know and just a desire to be successful again those things are really really good but they won't bring sales in the door uh, you need good people good systems you need a good forecast based on real data so again don't drink your own kool-aid make sure to research and do your homework thanks guys